Okay. Guys, um, we're looking for a green tree frog. They're usually right around the uh, back door, getting the insects up by the light. And we spotted none. And then all of a sudden, I took a look down here, and uh, a nice size one right down there. So I'm going to try to catch him and see if I can get him. Okay. So, yeah. Check him out. Yeah, this is ooh, slimy little bit. Oops. Careful. I'm trying to make him, just make him calm down. Yeah, there he is. He's so pretty. Check him out. See, this is. He's got the yellow stripe. He's, That? Why is it doing that? Okay, we had a little defect with the core fish pond. It just started, the water started going crazy and shooting up in the air, so we had to, oop, we had to stop for a second, but yeah, let me get my line on. Here's the guy we caught. And let's, uh, yeah, get a good little close up of him. Yeah, he's really pretty. He feels so cool, like, cause they, they just feel so neat, especially a big one like this. Um, I know they get pretty big, but, uh, yeah, he's, he's a decent size. And the, the yellow strip on him, it's really neat looking. Oh. Ah, got him. He always got away. Yeah. Oh. Huh? Check him out. Yeah, this is a really nice looking one. He's pretty. And um, there's a, I know we have a couple of different species of uh, tree frogs in this area. We got the gray tree frog and they're really cool. Um, which is what I think we might have found the other time. I think it was a baby uh, out there. It might have been a baby gray tree frog. I don't want to hold him too much because I don't want him to get, uh, uh, lose his moisture. But yeah, I just, I wish I could make him croak and get him to croak for you, but he probably is not going to. But I love, the one thing I love about the green tree frogs, this yellow strip, because it's really pretty looking going across their side. So yeah, we're going to uh, get a couple photos of this guy, and then we'll uh, uh, really see him back where I found him. Alright, he's going home. Um, or wherever he was.